Hi there, folks. The last thing I haven't shown you on our feed is uh, the cow feed. And conveniently, I just now have time to do some cow feed. So <clears throat> our cow feed's a lot different than our pig feed. The mineral we get here, which looks like this, I figured I'd actually show you guys what it all looks like this time. Uh, the mineral that we get is different than the ca uh, pig and chicken. It actually says that I'm only allowed to give 0.2 pounds I believe, per head per day. Now that is two pounds there because I'm mixing up an 80 pound batch and each of the cows are being fed 80 pounds, or I'm sorry, 40 pounds of feed. So the math works. Um, so we have that. We also have our base 14%, which here is two 20 pound buckets. And then this, is 11 pounds of soybean meal. And the reason that we use that is to increase the protein. And the bottom is 19 pounds of uh, regular base mix as well. So I'm gonna throw it all into the mixer. Alrighty guys, so I like to put a little bit of everything in at first and then mix the rest. It seems to mix better. So here's all of our high protein soybean meal. So we're gonna just dump that straight in. We're also going to dump straight in our mineral mix and then we're going to add at least uh, one bucket of plain corn feed. Um, so what that's going to start doing is the mineral will start mixing in and then as it's running, I'm sorry I'm not in frame, as it's running I'll throw the rest of the stuff in. Uh, I won't video that because it's going to be really loud and obnoxious and it's going to look exactly the same as this does. And then I'll show you guys the finished product when we're done. Well, that's what the finished product looks like. <clears throat> you see all them little black specks? That's the mineral that's in there. Um, that's not bugs or anything crazy. That's all mineral. And what I look for usually is that it's fairly even. I don't really mind that there's a clump here and that there's nothing right here. What I don't want to see is just a black line right here because that'll tell me that all the minerals in one spot or all the minerals here, wherever. Um, and then when we look in the bucket, because I already poured some out, you see the same thing, which actually might be harder here, but there's all kinds of specks everywhere. And uh, that's exactly what I'm looking for. So now all we do, throw them in our kitty litter bucket. And these are going to some 4-H cows, actually, along with that last square bale. Uh, we have a 4-H set that we sponsor, and so we help them out when stuff like this happens. And they need just a little bit of food to get them by, or they need <clears throat> whatever the case may be. So, alrighty guys, thank you so much. I'll see you on the next one.